morning everyone how are you doing on this beautiful friday morning we are here currently at wild eggs in downtown louisville kentucky and having breakfast with tons of people we have everybody over here yep brian's lawn maintenance hosted this event and uh we came on down just to show our support you know we absolutely love the community and there's tons of people in here so you can just take a look around i'm not going to start mentioning names maybe you can see yourself yeah maybe you can see yourself but i just don't want to mention names because i don't want to forget anybody but you know just a great event here we're gonna have a good time eat some good breakfast and just chat business up and you know make some make some more friends right? yeah absolutely and i'm gonna have some stuff french toast and i'm gonna have a <laughs> lot of coffee because i'm not awake yet and it's like seven o'clock in the morning yeah next year brian move it to like 9 45. just well, they were talking about dinner after the day. That would work too. That would work too. Anyways, guys, we're going to have a lot of fun here today at the last day at the GIE. Let's go ahead and hop into it. Let's do it. Let's go. All right, guys, so we're actually parking in the mountain this time, in the caverns Ooh, for the event. It dripped on me. <laughs> yeah, you might want to put that sunroof up. We are underground now. How cool is this? I see him. <laughs> Here's Sunny, well, this why I die. Daily Hustle, great big shout out to you guys for having the whole entire lawn care community out here, taking a photo with everybody. Look at the trucks in the background, guys. Hot. Looking awesome. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. All right, guys, currently getting ready to walk in. It's cold this morning. Sorry for no video yesterday. Uh, long story short, our GoPro and tripod came up missing. Somewhere between... Uh, Doing an event and leaving. I don't know if I set it on a trash can or somebody took it when we were doing some stuff. But uh, yeah, so I lost two days worth of footage. Just didn't have enough stuff to uh, put a video out, I guess you could say. But I'm going to do some recording on my phone today. TQ is going to do some recording on her phone. And uh, we're going to get you guys a video up here later today, Friday. And uh, we're going to be heading out of here a bit later today. What's up, guys? We are here with TQ's biggest fan, Peanut. Well, Jordan's her name. We'll call her Peanut. I like yeah. Peanut. <laughs> Hi, Peanut. Hi. Look at that smile. Isn't that infectious? You having fun? Yeah. That's awesome. TQ is going to hop on the Pro X 600, give it a try. Thing. What do you think? Honestly, it feels like the right. Yeah. Like the view of it and everything, it feels like being on the right. Yeah. Yeah. How you uh? How you like the big cushion? I didn't. I didn't really lean into it, but this is nice. 
Yeah, the adjustable? Yeah. Nice. All right, guys, she's on the Quick Cat 4000. Now, this is a lot bigger than the, uh, the one we got the demo at the beginning of the year. Definitely looks a lot different and def definitely has a bigger engine than what we've seen at the beginning of the year. Look at her. She's liking it already. I can tell. She's just showing off. Oh, she clipped the hay bale. I saw it. I, I won't knock her for it too bad. What do you think? So funny you there. Quick. Yeah. yeah. Look at you're moving pretty good. Yeah. I mean, it does the corners really smoothly and everything like that. Yeah, you were just showing off a little bit. I won't knock you for clipping that hay bell though. I saw you. I saw you <laughs> whipping it around out here showing off. See all these guys, guys. When a woman hops on these mowers, they're like, oh boy, everybody step back. And then she gets on it and she just shows off. <laughs> All right, guys, Sean's gonna try this Bravely Pro Stand 52. There you go. That's that's one feature I don't like. Yeah, I don't like that. the Toro. TQ had to come out here and show the boys how to run these machines. Look at her, she's about ready to lap everybody. You guys better pick it up. It's like an adult man or woman's playground seriously if you ever want to try anything you have to get to the GIE everybody's here everybody and it goes way down there guys way down there it's just so much you can't take it all in even in three days I've been coming five years now and I still haven't touched everything awesome look at green touch guys I will say they win the most colorful and best looking booth of the GIE for 2019. That's awesome, looks great. Good job, Green Touch.
Alrighty, so that is a wrap for GIE 2019. What'd you think, TQ, overall, real quick? Overwhelming. Overwhelming, for sure. That's <laughs> a lot. That's the quickest way, I guess, to say it. Yeah, absolutely. And it was so great to meet everyone that we did meet, and it was awesome. Man, made a lot of lifetime, lifelong friends, I guess you yeah, could say. Connections, yeah. And I'll tell you what, these guys are truly awesome. Every single one of them we met such a blessing to uh, form the relationships that we did and the friendships that we did uh, with so many people. I mean, so many. Absolutely. And uh, yeah, it was our pleasure, guys. I can't wait to do it next year, even though right now I'm, I can barely walk. I'm like a lot of you guys. So as always, keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. We'll talk to you later. Take you out. Peace. All right, guys. So check it out. All these people waiting so far. Get in. We got Paul Jamison over here. TQ. Very cool, very cool.